back for another video. Today I'm going to show you how to set up two monitors. So the first thing I'm going to do is um, I'm running a MacBook Pro and I have a Samsung monitor attached. So um, right now I'm capturing the uh, Samsung screen. Um, first thing I'm going to show you how to do is adjust the menu bar depending on which screen you want it to be on. What you're going to do is go to System Preferences and go into your displays and now you're going to go to this arrangement tab and as you can see you have your two arrangements you can switch around which desktop is where and such but what I'm going to do is move the menu bar so the menu bar is represented by this little white bar at the top and when you move it it's going to also move your icons and your dock and so all you have to do is click on it and drag it and you can switch it to either computer. I'm going to go ahead and leave it on this one because this is my larger monitor and I like to have it here. Now, one thing I really miss on the second monitor is that it doesn't have a menu bar or a dock. And so I'm going to show you, I haven't found out how to get a dock yet, but I'm going to show you how you can put on a basic menu bar on that second uh, monitor. Let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be using a program called Second Bar. Um, I'll give you the link to it right there. So go ahead and download it. You should download to your downloads folder or whatever directory you have specified for that. Guys, I just wanted to add that it does say that it only works in Snow Leopard, but I am running Lion and it is working just fine. So I just wanted to be clear on that. Go ahead and unzip it with whatever unzipping tool you use. Once it's done unzipping, it will have the application. Um, you can move it into your uh, applications folder whenever you want, but I'm just going to go ahead and put it there. Now, um, to run it, it's very simple. All you have to do is, hang on, let me go ahead and close this. All you have to do is double click on it, and it's going to ask me if I want to open it because I downloaded it from the internet. I'm going to hit OK. And it's going to, after a few seconds, and let me try again. There we go. Um, now it just opened up on my other desktop. As you can see, I have a uh, menu bar over here now. It's very basic, it's missing all of the icons I have on the other side. Um, but it is still functioning and I really like it because I can open a new finder window and it's a lot easier than having to go over and bring in whatever I'm trying to work on. Um, uh, let me show you how you can edit preferences. Uh, you'll go right here, click on the time, hit preferences, bring it back over here. And now you're going to want to uh, set it so that it will show the dock. Um, you're going to want to add this into your startup menu. I'll show you how to do that in a second. And then you're also going to want to, most likely, if you're running a laptop, say, show second bar after launching, even if there's only one monitor available. You're going to want to turn that off. Otherwise, you're going to have two menu bars when you're using just one monitor. So now let's go ahead and add that into our startup items. Uh, right here, go to Apple, get system preferences. Now we're going to go to user accounts, go to login items, and all you have to do is hit the plus, and you can search for second bar, and there you go, hit add that, and now it will open when your computer turns on. Thanks for watching guys, please go ahead and subscribe, it really helps me out. Thanks uh, for watching. See you later. Bye.